Now, KSBW Weather. This is Phil Frame in for Art Jarrett. This was the scene a couple of hours ago looking out from the Embassy Suites. The low clouds and fog are actually in retreat. They pushed in. Now they're pulling back. This is the latest, most current image, and you can see they're way back there. The sun is setting, but they'll probably come back in again tonight. Now, the effect of the low clouds was to cool the temperatures off if you were near the water. In the Santa Cruz Mountains, though, temperatures were generally a little bit warmer. If you were in the Monterey Bay area today, though, they were cooler across the board. And here in the Salinas Valley, from about Gonzales northward, it was cooler, and to the south, it was warmer. And then in the Santa Clara Valley, the northern part of the Santa Clara Valley, San Jose, was cooler. The rest, a little bit warmer than yesterday. Here is the current image, and temperatures are still very mild. We do have a few low clouds offshore, but nothing significant as of yet. This is our satellite image. This is a visible satellite. This is that cold front I was talking about last night. It has moved closer. It's now about 200 miles away behind it. Polar air, it's going to move through tomorrow. We're going to get into the polar air, and what little marine layer we have now will be mixed out, but we'll also see cooler temperatures everywhere, and that includes the inland areas. And then after tomorrow, we're going to see some changes. Here's the situation according to Futurecast. We have rain expected from San Francisco northward. I don't think we're going to see anything around here. And then afterward, high pressure builds in briefly for Tuesday and Wednesday, so we'll see more sun and warmer temperatures and then after Tuesday Friday we start to see the jet stream slowly sag southward and it looks like this next system might actually give us rain for next weekend not a lot but we won't complain as far as temperatures for tomorrow it is going to be cooler in the San Francisco Bay Area 60s and 70s it's also going to be cooler in the Santa Clara Valley tomorrow with highs in the 70s under partly cloudy skies, partly cloudy and cooler here in the Salinas Valley, highs in the 70s, and then partly cloudy and cooler in the Monterey Bay area, highs generally in the 60s, although there'll be a few low 70s, also 60s and 70s in the Santa Cruz County area, and so for the next seven days, we see temperatures continue to cool through Tuesday, rebounding a little bit, but then cooling off significantly with Light rain, likely, I would say, in most parts of the central coast on Saturday, late Friday and Saturday. We'll keep you posted on that. A lot of these systems, they start to die out. So keep your fingers crossed. We might actually get measurable rain. Oh, the words